Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Fluctus channel. In the constantly changing world of modern air warfare, filled with advanced technologies, fifth generation fighter jets have become crucial as countries compete to control the skies. Among these, the F-35 stands out as a prime example of air power. Designed for missions ranging from high altitude to electronic warfare, the F-35 doesn't necessarily highlight today's transition to a versatile, all-weather operational aircraft, not only on many, but also represents a major advance in aviation technology. The F-35 represents the peak of stealth fighter technology, designed to minimize radar detection while showcasing advanced combat performance. As the second fifth generation fighter in US service, it integrates advanced avionics and sensor fusion to offer exceptional situational awareness and long-range lethality. The aircraft is built with a focus on versatility, featuring a wingtail configuration with canted vertical stabilizers for stealth and uses composites to balance weight and strength. This design philosophy ensures it remains highly effective in suppressing enemy air defenses, as highlighted by the U.S. Air Force. Each model, from the F-35A to the F-35C, incorporates lessons from the F-22, optimizing aerodynamics and materials for reduced radar signature and enhanced durability. Positioning the F-35 as a formidable asset in modern aerial combat. Stealth technology fundamentally changes the dynamics of modern combat and is designed to make an aircraft invisible to radar and other detection systems. The F-35 leverages this technology through several advanced features. The outer body of the aircraft is designed with sharp edges and specific geometric shapes that help decrease its radar cross-section by scattering and trapping radar waves, rather than reflecting them back to the source. The aircraft is also coated with a radar absorbent material that further diminishes its visibility to enemy sensors. The F-35 stealth capabilities are enhanced by internalizing critical components. Sensors, weapons, and fuel tanks are all housed within the aircraft's structure to maintain a sleek, non-reflective profile. This design minimizes its infrared signature by reducing the heat detected by enemy systems. Stealthy systems against radar and electromagnetic threats grant the F-35 a significant advantage. This makes the F-35 invisible. When looking at the F-35's features, one standout is its powerful weapon, the Gao 22A 25mm Gatling gun. This isn't just any gun, it's specifically designed to work with the F-35's gun systems. The GAU 22A is key for the jet's flexibility and effectiveness in battle. It weighs 230 pounds and can fire up to 3,300 rounds per minute, 
with a strong recoil force of 3,700 pounds. This gun can be operated by hydraulic, electric, or pneumatic systems and uses different types of ammunition feeds, really showcasing the F-35's powerful capabilities in the air. In addition to its powerful weapons, the F-35 also features an advanced electro-optical targeting system, EOTS, greatly improving its accuracy for hitting ground targets and engaging other aircraft. This system gives pilots top-notch targeting and surveillance capabilities, helping them stay ahead in combat. The EOTS is the first system in the world to combine forward-looking infrared, FLIR, and infrared search and tracking IRST technologies. These allow it to provide clear images, track targets automatically, and accurately measure distances with lasers. It's built right into the body of the F-35 under a tough sapphire window to keep the plane's sleek shape and reduce air resistance. The system connects directly to the plane's main computer. It sends important data through a fiber optic link, giving pilots a clear understanding of their surroundings and a strong advantage during missions. The sophisticated systems installed in the F-35 also contribute to its maintenance demands, with the annual budget for an individual aircraft running around $6 million. This high cost reflects the complexity and advanced technology that make the F-35 a formidable fighter, requiring specialized care and regular updates to maintain its operational readiness and technological edge. Similar to the F-35's GAO 22A, the General Electric GAO 8A Avenger serves as a predecessor in the lineage of powerful Gatling-style auto cannons. This formidable 30mm 7-barrel cannon is primarily mounted in the Fairchild Republic A-10 a platform designed specifically for ground attack. The GAO 8A Avenger excels in delivering high-power rounds rapidly, making it particularly effective in destroying a wide variety of ground targets. It's only downhill from here. Beyond its application in the A-10, the Avenger also plays a critical role in the Goalkeeper Close-In Weapon System, SeaWiz, used on naval ships, providing robust defense against short-range, highly maneuverable threats, including missiles, aircraft, and fast surface vessels. Like the GAO 22A, the GAO 8A is produced by General Dynamics, marking a continued tradition of excellence in military armaments. While discussing the impressive weaponry of modern military aircraft, it's pertinent to examine another renowned platform, the A-10 Warthog known for its substantial arsenal designed for varied combat scenarios. Beyond its cannon, the A-10 features a versatile array of hardpoints, with a total of 11 available, strategically distributed on both wings and the fuselage. These hardpoints carry a formidable payload capacity of 16,000 pounds, offering a range of munition options. From rockets, including the Hydra 70mm APKWS and Hydra 70 rockets, to air-to-air -air missiles such as the AIM-9 Sidewinder and formidable air-to-surface AGM-65 Mavericks, 
The A-10 is a true force multiplier in the theater of operations. The A-10's versatility shines through with the capacity to carry a diverse array of bombs. This includes the Mark 80 series of unguided iron bombs, the Mark 77 incendiary bombs, and an assortment of cluster bombs like the Blue 1, Blue 27B, CBU-20 Rock I-2, and BL-755, among others. For precision-guided strikes, the A-10 is equipped to deploy the Paveway series of laser-guided bombs and the Joint Direct Attack Munition, JDAM, in its A-10C variant. While we've explored the A-10 Warthog's impressive combat capabilities, it's equally crucial to delve into the meticulous maintenance routines that keep these robust machines in peak condition. At the core of the A-10's robust design is its dual General Electric TF-34 GE 100A turbo fans, each producing a remarkable 9,065 pounds of thrust. Maintaining these engines involves precise and careful procedures, including thorough inspections and, occasionally, complete removals for detailed examination. Technicians meticulously check for any signs of wear or minor cracks in the engine mounts, flaws that could potentially expand and cause significant damage over time. In cases requiring more extensive maintenance, the engines are transported to a specialized facility known as the Hush House. Here, they undergo a comprehensive series of checks from performance assessments to the replacement of deteriorated parts. This detailed attention ensures each engine functions flawlessly, which is vital for the A-10's effectiveness in its demanding combat role. The A-10 Warthog's modular design is a key feature that greatly improves its maintenance efficiency. This design is particularly evident in its wing structure, which can be swiftly replaced if it gets damaged. By lifting the aircraft and detaching the damaged wing, technicians can easily install a new one with the help of a lift. This efficient process speeds up repairs and reduces downtime, keeping the aircraft ready for action. The ability to perform repairs simultaneously, fixing a damaged wing while integrating a new one, highlights the A-10's design foresight, enhancing its readiness for critical missions. Such strategic maintenance practices highlight the A-10's durability and flexibility in facing operational challenges. The A-10 has proven itself to be a dependable aircraft in the conflicts in Iraq and Afghanistan. Particularly effective in close air support roles. However, there are increasing concerns about its ability to cope with the sophisticated air defenses of nations like China. For years, the Air Force has sought congressional approval to phase out the A-10 in favor of more advanced aircraft. This effort faced repeated rejections until the 2023 budget, which initiated the gradual retirement of the A-10. This development indicates a shift in military strategy prioritizing aircraft that can excel in more demanding situations and adapt to evolving global security challenges. From its unmatched capabilities in close air support to the recent debates about its future, 
The A-10 exemplifies the ongoing evolution of military technology and strategy. As it begins its phased retirement, the legacy of the Warthog will undoubtedly influence future developments in combat aircraft design and deployment. That's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of our new content. See you next time.